In this Madden 21 quick tip, I'm going to show you a one play touchdown against the meta cover uh, two man pressure defense. What's up, guys? My name is Cody. If you've never been to my YouTube channel, I just want to say thank you for watching today. My YouTube channel is, in short, basically about helping me and helping you get better at Madden because what I've found is as um, as I put the time in and the work in and we share ideas, it helps both of us get better. So this is just a play concept that I wanted to break down really, really quickly for you about how you can beat what I believe to be one of the meta coverages in Madden 21. So the meta coverages honestly is man-to-man -man coverage. That's the best way to play the game this year. Um, and you're seeing that people will drop their curl flats at that 25 yard mark. So what I wanna do is show a little bit of a trick to be able to beat this now you want to put your best wide receiver um this is from the arizona cardinals playbook which i wrote a entire ebook on if you want to get the full scheme which covers several formations in the arizona cardinals playbook uh, it has several hours of video footage and video breakdown as well as written breakdown you can pick up the scheme full scheme the link in the description it says madden 21 competitors guide you can pick it up right there but basically what you want to do is you want to put your best route runner in this right slot right here so i've got Devonte adams here for the packers um if you're the cowboys that's where i would put amari cooper it's where i would put chris godwin if you're the bucks so whoever your best route runner is that's where you want to put him right there i'm going to show you this basically um what we're going to do is we're going to set up the meta coverage and what you're used to seeing is if i try to throw let me just show you if i try to throw this fade route to mvs because they've shaded outside and shaded over the top you're going to see that I can't throw this ball. That's what makes this coverage so good. It effectively allows you to play cover zero and drop zones underneath. So now what I want to do is I want to show you the same principle. But all you're going to do is as soon as Devontae Adams makes his cut and gets separation, you're just going to lob the ball over the top of the defense. So right there he makes his cut, gets that separation, click on, and you see that I'm going to click onto the receiver, do a little swerve catch, and I'm going to be off to the races against man-to-man -man coverage. This, to me, is truly one of the best routes in Madden 21 that nobody's really talking about. And I've tried to bring a lot of awareness to it on my channel. I actually did a video where I truly break down why this route is so good against every coverage because it also beats cover two uh, and cover three, uh, respectively. But what you see here is once he gets that cut, you see most of the time he's going to get that kind of separation um, right there. When you click onto the receiver, it is really important um, to click onto your receivers this year. And you're going to see if they press coverage this, it's actually much, much more effective. All I'm going to do, and right there, Jones is able to make a nice play. But on the first cut, once he starts to get that space right there, you see I'm going to hit him right in that seam. And it's going to be about a 15 to 30 yard um, 30 yard play because of the fact that the safeties are deep. That's going to keep it from being a one play touchdown. But what I do want you to see is if they take the safeties away and they're playing the meta coverages that we all love this year, if you click on receiver, just swerve catch him, you're typically going to get a nice little over-the-shoulder grab. Um, and if you can't if you can't do this, part of this also is because of Jonathan Jones' speed, and I'm throwing the ball a little bit late here. If you smart route this route, it's going to get you a little bit better separation. Um, but what you'll see here, right in there, click on, and you're going to be able to make a play with Devontae Adams. But this is one of the best routes in Madden NFL 21. I do want to show if they press coverage because uh, a lot of people this year have been running bench press. So I want to show you what this looks like against, like, if they have a press animation. So you see here, he'll get off the press, and you're going to be able to easily fit that in again. Now, if there's a safety there, one of the things that I'm making the mistake of on in this video is I'm not possession catching it if there's a safety over top. If there's a safety over top, just secure catch it, and he's not going to drop it. It's going to be very, very simple uh, for your offense. You'll see right here, again, right in there, pass lead inside, and you're going to be able to click on and make that catch for about 15 to 30 yards, depending. But if they take the safeties away, um, even if they only play like, like let's say they have one safety high, so something like this right here where you have one safety high, maybe you drop a coverage over on the left, what you're going to see here is I can actually um, get this out and over the top. It's probably one of the best cover. Um, I shouldn't have high pointed it. It's probably one of the best cover one beaters as well. Basically, as long as there's no deep half zone on the right side or on the left side of the field, you're going to be good against this. This is a really, really good play. Um, and you'll see why. You see right here against that cover one defense. Any kind of cover three or cover one D, this is going to absolutely torch it. Pretty much the only hope that they have, honestly, with defending this play is if they're um, is if their corners on the outsides in a cover two type of scenario 
um, do play it really well. But you see here, you could actually get it over the top of the cover two very, very easily. Now, again, I do want to show one last time, if they shade coverage out, shade coverage over top, and they press, what you're going to see here is Devontae Adams is going to get that nice separation right in there on that third cut, and it's going to absolutely torch the man-to-man -man coverage over the top for a really, really nice gain, and most of the time, a one-play touchdown. If you actually, and real quick, one last thing before I take off, if you like to lob the ball, one of the things you'll see here is with Aaron Rodgers, if I just, um, right when he gets that separation, just lob it right over the top, you're going to see there, I'm going to get that nice click on animation that we love about those over shoulder rack catches against the man-to-man -man coverage. So I just wanted to break this down. I find this to be, I'm really falling in love with this play and I just find it being consistently even better the more that I lab it up, especially with wide receivers that have really, really good route running like a Devonte Adams. It's also going to beat the one step ahead ability because it has multiple cuts. So there's really not a whole lot the defense can do other than user this specific route. I want to thank you guys for watching. If you want to get my entire offensive and defensive ebooks, you can do that by getting the Madden 21 competitive guide, which is in the description of this video. And if you want even more in depth analysis about how you can improve in Madden 21, number one, you can always text me. My number is 812 216 3644. It's in the top left of the description. You can also join the Discord, which is in the description as well. It's a place where we can all kind of collaborate together in one area. But Honestly, you can also grab a coaching session. Some of the guys have been asking for this. I've started doing one-on-one -on -one coaching to really help you guys take your games to the next level. And I feel like so far, everyone that's had a coaching session has walked away with a lot more than they thought they would. So it's a really, really good opportunity for you. If you want to pick that up, you can pick up all of that stuff in the description. Thank you so much for your time. There's going to be some other videos that are going to pop up on your screen here that I would like you to check out. And also, just a reminder, we live stream every single night at 10 o'clock p.m. Eastern time. So we'll see you there tonight.